And this is very important. This is the moment where you should be paying attention to me. Welcome everybody, I'm Fabio Viviani and you're watching Fabio's Kitchen where every week we'll bring you an amazing dish made by me and today we're making one of my favorite dishes mac and cheese we are doing some fried chicken how to make potato gnocchi you're welcome since we're doing Italian tacos today Buenos dias mio amigo everybody loves meatball pizza You can use the 100% of your asparagus, even the white part, as long as you use a potato peeler and you peel off the skin at the end. Polenta at the end of the day is where Greece wants to be when you go to vacation in Europe, Italy. That's probably the ticket that you should pay at least 100 bucks to me to teach you how to make gnocchi, because you're gonna look like a rock star. I'm reckless, so I don't care about my finger, but you have to be very careful at your house don't chop your finger off because you don't want to be a rock star and wave like this, all right? When the pasta is ready, it's going to do the hula hoop. See that? Are you afraid that my cheese sauce is not proper? Do you want me to jump rope with my cheese sauce? So if I dip the tip of this in the oil, and it starts to bubble, I know that my oil is at the perfect temperature for frying. There is a slight difference between Aquaman and an Italian Aquaman. In both cases, we love fishes, but one of them talks to them, the other one cooks them. Me. He was talking to the seafood, talking to the creature under the water, by kind of telepathically communicating them. It worked. First of all, we gotta make a fan. See there? Now you go here. I'm telling you, this is the move of 2016. Our spaghetti is nice and drunk. That's an Italian tablespoon, whatever comes out. The potatoes are moist, the celery is delicious, the snappy, amazing. Oh, I gotta eat, I gotta eat. Oh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a very hot bite. Ah! Ah! Delicious.